Good morning, skiers and riders. Sugarloaf and Carabas Valley. Hope you're ready for a great day and a great weekend. Enjoying the outdoors. You can find this and much more at WSKITV.com. This is your latest local forecast brought to you by the Widowmaker. Find them upstairs in the base lodge. For the day today, we'll see that full sunshine, especially first thing in the morning, and then clouds will increase throughout the day. The wind, not really an issue. Barely noticeable up towards the top of the mountain and down here around the base. 19 to 23 for your summer temperatures. Base temperatures warming up to the upper 20s. So with that sunshine this morning and no wind, it should feel great out there. Get out there and rip it up. Sunday, the wind will pick up just a bit from the south south West bringing in a little bit warmer temperatures 26 to 30 at the base 21 to 25 for your summit temperatures and mostly cloudy skies so have those goggles that show some definition in the snow and whatnot and get out there and enjoy it those mostly cloudy skies will stick around for the beginning of the week uh, it does well. I do want to make note, it does look like we may get an inch or so of snow uh, overnight Sunday night into Monday, but mostly cloudy skies for Monday, high temperature of 37 degrees, Tuesday a high of 33 with mostly cloudy skies, and then things start to uh, drop off just a little bit, 28 for your high on Wednesday with partly sunny skies. So get out there and enjoy it. Snowmakers and grooming have been doing a great job out there. Loose granular, frozen granular conditions, make sure to check out Birchwood Interiors online, birchwoodinteriors.com. They are in Village West as well. 28 trails of ski and ride on eight lifts getting into those runs 25 trails on the groomers list last night trails like narrow gauge from the extension they did not get lower gauge bridal chain tote road lower timber line king's landing and hayburner upper upper double bitter double bitter uh, windrow spur line birches and snowbrook as well as sluice headwall sluice uh, candy side lower winter's way and the landing snowmaking wrapping up on windrow then heading over to haywire scoot snubber spur line the stomping grounds park as well as west mountain so these temperatures have been great for them they've been out there Really hammering it out the good stuff. Snubber gets going at 8 o'clock this morning to get you up to the base lodge. Skidway and Sawduster get going at 8.30 to move you around the base area. If you're just learning to ski or ride, that's where you want to head. Skyline and Super Quad get you to a variety of mid-mountain terrain. Double Runner East and West get going at 8.30 uh, to service the lower mountain. And Timberline gets going at 9 a.m. And with the full sunshine this morning, clear skies, you'll see some great views from up top there. Open for skiing and fat biking down at the Sugarloaf Outdoor Center. Also, the ice rink should be open, and they've got snowshoe rentals, cross-country ski rentals, fat bike rentals for everything. Bull Moose Bakery is open as well, and they've got uh, beverages down there. Fat bike trail conditions, the uh, the trails are in pretty good shape. Uh, Mead Trail is a bit icy, but other than that, things are in really good shape. So get out there. It's fast and firm. And just uh, be aware of others out there. The Bag and Kettle offering up uh, reservations if you want to. And they've got their famous bag burgers and wood-fired pizzas. The Widowmaker right upstairs in the base lodge now doing dinner. Uh, so be sure to check them out. Shipyard Brew House. If you're looking for something different to do for Christmas dinner, check out their one-day-only Chinese food. Saw the menu and it looks pretty good. Bullwinkles, they've got a bunch of awesome stuff is up there as well to hang out outside, keep warm and whatnot. So be sure to check out Bullwinkles right at the top of West Mountain, the anti-gravity complex for your indoor activity. Uh, they've got a, some uh, CDC, CDC guidelines and restrictions you need to follow, but they are open for business. And the, out, uh, the Sugarloaf Sports and Fitness Center also, uh, you need reservations uh, to get in there, but you and your pod can enjoy some of the stuff down there with privacy. Backhoe Financial, proud to be the lead sponsor of the Sugarloaf Char Charity Summit, so be sure to check them out if you're in the market for some personalized financial planning. You can always find us online, WSKITV.com, as well as our Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram feeds for all the info to know before you go.